there's a lot of conversation about mindset. Mindset is a excellent way to transition out of burnout. Once you discover what is limiting your belief system or your mindset. So mindset is defined from a psychological point of view as the belief that orients something or someone. So let's kind of break that down. It is the way that we filter life. We make decisions, we interact, we socialize, or etc. And so the mindset is the point of view of how we begin to look at things and the way that the we look at things as how we make decisions and determine our behaviors, our feelings, and our thoughts. So making sense and understanding that your mindset basically is the meaning of how you handle situations. Now, handling situations are relevant to our perspective. We cannot have a conversation about mindset and not discuss perspective. Perspective is the way that we view things, all right? So if we view things out of our orientation or how we uh, look at a situation, then it is so obvious that our decisions will be filtered through how we see things. When we are in the burnout phase or overly stressed, we only see things through that pain. So the pain of things not going well, the pain of our abilities not showing up in our outcomes or our productivity. And so that's painful for a business owner not to see production, not to see cash flow. And when these things are not apparent, our efforts then becomes demotivated thus leading us to feeling more and more stress. So imagine a business owner who is stressed. What are they going to do? They're going to see things, perspective, right? Through their belief system, I'm not producing the way that I need to. This is shameful. I'm tired of not having a paycheck. I'm tired of having to dip into my personal funds to float my business. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. And so when this situation occurs, then we'll go back to the fundamentals of the definition. This is relevant to how they make decisions handle situations from that pain point. Now, we never want to make a decision from our pain point because that's when we make costly mistakes. So, you see, mindset is very relevant to how we handle our business, handle our personal lives, handle our health, handle our mental health, and the list just go on and on to include our relationships. A lot of times when we're in this pain point, when we feel like we're doing our best, but then our energy is just being depleted because our results are not linked towards the level of expectation that we've had from the uh, the work or the communication or the list just goes on and on. And that's when we become solely disappointed or demotivated. So my point is to help you to understand your mindset is relevant to how you handle situations, which is then filtered through your perspective out of born out of pain, discomfort, or what you feel is not going right. So what you have to do then is figure out how to get rid of the things that are not working or operating right in your business, thereby taking an evaluation and inventory of yourself. How do we do that? We take a piece of paper, we write down the things that are chaotic in our life. Don't forget your personal life. Don't forget your business life. Don't forget your relationships life. That's relationship in the business, out of the business. You must evaluate. And so one of the next videos we're going to be talking about is really what does evaluation really mean and how does it help me to conquer and overcome stress? We'll discuss that. Stay tuned. Have a good day.
Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.